Hello. Today I will be learning how to box from a very special guest, Jake Paul. Jake, why don't you say hi? Hey Chad Chad, it's an honor to be here. Well Jake, it's an honor to have you here. Why don't you tell us a little bit about what we're gonna be doing today? Sure, well first I'll be showing you a little strategy I found to be very successful in winning fights. If uh, if done correctly, it has a 100% success rate. That's incredible, Jake. It that's is. an amazing achievement so early on. It is. In your career, congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, it really is. Okay, well I guess I'm ready whenever you are. <laughs> What's this? Just take it. I thought we were gonna fight. We are, just take the money. Okay. Now what? All right, now let me win. What? <laughs> hey guys, and welcome back to A Twinge of Clean. My name is Chad Chad. Not really. And today we're gonna be taking a look into the appalling world of Jake and Logan. I'm sorry, I promise I have better jokes in this video. I'm filming this after getting my second dose of the Axine Bay, so please keep that in mind when you're passing judgment on my puns. Also, go get vaccinated. It's easy, it's quick, and why would you pass up on the once in a lifetime opportunity of actually getting something for free in America? <laughs> I think if you're on the internet, you have at least some knowledge of Logan and Jake, whether it be voluntarily or against your will. If you're like me, it's the latter. Most of what I learn about them is through news articles because if there was an award for YouTubers most in the news for doing bad things on both a YouTube and real world standard, uh, they would get it. They would get the award for that. Hey, will you take a picture with me? <laughs> sure, I'm not kissing you. <laughs> I will kill you! Like two very problematic grapes departing from their cluster, Jake and Logan came from Vine. And with the YouTube platform just waiting to be Concord, Enough! They made their way into internet infamy. Where's all my middle schoolers at? Oh my god, oh my god, they're self aware. Elementary school? Oh my god, they're so self-aware! One of the first things I heard about them after Vine shut down was during that era on YouTube when almost every channel was reacting to the music video It's Every Day Bro, which had more flow than a progressive commercial and was posted four years ago. Four years. Four. There were so many videos posted about it that I don't think there's anything left for me to contribute in 2021. So I'm gonna move on to their more current content. Jake is obviously a professional boxer. You know, his brother is a lot more talented, has a larger following. Those, those type of things. That's like, that's like calling Kylie Jenner, Kendall Jenner. Like, doesn't matter, still, still a compliment. <laughs> you ever whoop your ass when you were the little brother? That, that was a question, Jake. You're supposed to. I, I don't. I just don't care about your questions. Fifty people wanted to win. Fifty people wanted to lose, and I, I was shocked because it's got to be like 90, 10. Pretty amazing how many people don't like you. I, I, I actually kind of find it pretty impressive your ability to be disliked. He's dealing one sign of contact. Yeah, uh, 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 well, I'm trying uh, to wait for you to stop talking. Okay. Uh, uh, Bro, you and Bernie, uh, 36. Uh, <laughs> Uh, so a lot of his content is related to that. But there is this. This was posted end of last year. And this looks good. I bet it's great. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for coming tonight. Let's give it up. Welcome to the first annual training camp talent show. Hi, I'm DK, and I reside from Los Angeles, California, and tonight I will be showing you guys some of my great tricks. It is going to be called the Ice Hole Challenge. I'm going to squeeze ice in my hand, and it, when I open my hand, it will not be there. So you mean like you're going to hold an ice cube until it melts, and that's your, that's your talent? Amaze a woman. We have to retreat. The aliens are too strong. We're losing a lot of people. Don't worry, okay? We still have... Melt-a-cube. Hey, I'm Melt-a-cube. 
What the hell is he gonna do? Well, I think it's pretty self-explanatory, Llama Girl. He's gonna melt a cube, watch. Yeah, so I just... Oh no, they have melt a cube, guys, we gotta go. Oh my god, it's working, they're running away. Thank you guys very much, thank you guys so much. Sit down, sit down. The haters will be there. It's on, it's on. What are these cuts? Like, I guess they add to the video if you're trying to make it more comical. I would like to place emphasis on the word trying, but after a while they just get obnoxious. I feel like I can't really show the rest of this video just because of the pure amount of ass in it. He takes pictures with an ass to promote his new music video and then he eats eggs off of an ass. But I can pretty much sum it up for you. Hey guys, Today we're going to be filming a music video. I'm going to be taking pictures with an ass in my face, and then I'm going to be doing fight stuff. Be sure to buy my merch, by the way. We have phone cases, sweatshirts, t-shirts. Please, for the love of God, buy my merch. All my videos get demonetized, and I don't know why. Logan's recent content seems to be much more bearable. He has that new podcast, and he's also doing the fighting thing. I'll answer the Muhammad Ali question. George Foreman. If you tell me what seven times eight is. Why are we still here? You can't do math. Uh, I've made a severe and continuous lack of my judgment. Very low right Your now. hands are shaking. Nope. Your hands are shaking and your fingers are small. Okay, well. That probably has something to do with him getting a new PR team and or manager after a little something that happened in 2018 that rhymes with ilming a lead dotty. I've made a severe and continuous lapse in my judgment. In more recent controversies, Jake and his squad were seen looting a mall in the midst of last year's protests where Jake is on video saying, Hey yo, give me a free yeah, cologne. Yeah. He was charged with criminal trespass, but it got dropped, which in the world of a wealthy white man with a huge social media following probably just means that. But let's talk about the incident that just happened and actually inspired this video. The stuff I've read about this mostly uses Jake's name, but I think it's safe to assume that Logan is driving the other golf cart considering he's the one who lives in Puerto Rico. It also says they're launching an investigation, but I think we all know how that's gonna go. Hey, you can't do that. That's bad. Is it though? Excellent point. Mr. Paul, have a great day. Jake's defense, of course, has been that he didn't know you're not supposed to race golf carts on the beach and that it's turtle nesting season. And I'm sure there are zero signs or guidelines on the beach that would have educated him on that. Order in the court. Order in the I said order in the court. Jared, on the charge of homicide, how do you plead? I'm not guilty, Your Honor. Jared, there's... There's a video of you committing homicide against Mr. Douglas. Well, yes, but Your Honor, you see, I, I didn't know that you're not supposed to commit homicide. Be that as it may, Jared, there was a sign next to Mr. Douglas clearly stating not to kill him. I, yes, well, I didn't see that sign. Well, why didn't you say so? Case dismissed. I think the Paul brothers are like those boisterous teenage cousins that show up to family events and do the most reckless shit, but are instantly forgiven and never see any consequences from their parents because they're just boys being boys and having fun. But the world is not your parent, and it doesn't have to continue to forgive you over and over again when you do stuff that you should have known not to do. And if you're too clueless to function or to meet societal expectations of decency like you claim to be every time you do something wrong, then maybe you're too clueless to have the audience that you have. I'm gonna call it there, guys. Thank you for subscribing, and if you are still here, 
thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you clicking on my video out of all the videos that are on here, and I'll see you next time. Okay, bye.